Al Michaels with John Madden and Lisa Guerrero. Welcome to Oakland, where the overriding story took place yesterday afternoon in Mississippi when Brett Favre's father, Irv, drove off the road and died, apparently of a massive heart attack. And then, cruel as it is, Brett Favre had to make a decision. Does he play tonight or doesn't he play tonight? He has chosen to play. Playoff hunt against the Oakland Raiders. Ryan Longwell, who last week eclipsed Don Hudson as the Green Bay Packers all time leading scorer. And that is a, a monstrous feat. Granted, one was a great receiver, even though Hudson did do some field goal kicking. Longwell, a, a pure kicker. And he'll kick to Doug Gabriel, a rookie out of Central Florida, who's come along from the middle of the season on and has sparked the Oakland special teams. So in a game vital to Green Bay's playoff and division title hopes, here we go, as Gabriel feels it at the seven-yard line. And Gabriel with a decent run back, thrown his way twice. Third down and eight. Meyer, the noted Damer, under pressure, and Rick goes down at the 43-yard line. And this is Amon Green. Third down and 11. Favre has time, Favre going deep, and the ball is caught on the run by Robert Ferguson. Packers third in the league in rushing, and the Raiders are next to last in rushing defense. And Favre throws, and that is caught by Wesley Walls for a touchdown. The long-time tight end, one-time 49er across the bay. A beautiful pass and a great catch by Walls. Comes into the game, the noted Damer in the backfield. And they flip it to him, and he has some blocking. And Fisher is able to scramble free inside the 30 to the 22. And, and that's 32 yards on a third down and 12. And now Favre, who is 5 for 5 for 105 yards, is 6 for 6 and a touchdown to Javon Walker. And that deals with the pittsburgh Baltimore game, believe it or not. All crazy things. On third and three, Charlie Garner to the 40-yard line. Offensive left guard is six foot eight. Now that's a big guard. Big hole for Garner inside the 10, and the Raiders are right back in the game. He did before when they threw him a screen for 32. Now they need eight, and now the catch is made by Javon Walker. He hauls it in. Good first quarter, and now Najee Davenport in the game and running back. Brett Favre who has not misfired. He's 7 of 7, and the perfect game continues as Robert Ferguson makes the catch, obviously, but he's also an extraordinary guy. Second and a short four. Starts to go to his left, under pressure, and he gets taken down. You don't know how you handle those things, but, but he's doing it because he's Brett Favre. Third down and 11, and he slings it perfectly into the arms of Donald Driver and takes that to the 19-yard line. Perfecto. From the 11 yard line, they begin this drive with Amon Green through the middle behind that offensive line. And or here's a third and nine. Farm swings it to the outside, and the catch is made inbounds by Robert Ferguson. Another great grab. It's right in front of the Oakland bench. And it's also right in front of Philip Buchanan again. If you say Oakland is assessed a timeout because of the unsuccessful challenge and Favre going deep into double coverage and it is caught by Javon Walker in front of two Raiders for a touchdown. Formation doesn't necessarily mean they're going to run and they won't and Meyer is going to sling one into traffic and it is incomplete. Tim Brown the intended receiver is at the 43 yard line. Brett Favre. Gets away from Cooper. He, when he goes to his left, he is so good. He completes it here. With your the clothes on. The, look where the ball is. Now he's going to get contacted. Right there. Yeah. Oh, it's very well. He, the yellow line is on the 47 and a half. It's right about there. After reviewing the play, the ruling on the field stands. Completed pass. First down. Maybe he just misstated what he was looking at. First down from the 48-yard line. Favre again into a lot of traffic, and how in the world does Javon Walker make that? The ball, that's that's what you have to do in a zone defense. You, you have to get back, you have to see the ball. First round pick 
in 2002 having a, a monster night. And that pass is caught by David Martin, and he gets into the act with a touchdown. Second and nine. And that's caught by Jerry Rice, and there's a guy who's dominated a few games in his time. And this is going to be over soon. I want to, I want to make memories. And Rick Meyer would like to forget that and get that out of his memory bank as Bao Ju comes in from the corner. So it's fourth down at the 50 yard line. And Meyer, well, he's going to get taken down at the 41, and they're going to turn the ball over here as Kabir Baja Biamila is in there. That first half is, is simply unbelievable. Najee Davenport at the 10, running it back. And the Packers begin the second half with a long run back and Janikowski space coming over the top of your head. Second and ten, Green. That's behind Henderson. Horrible tackling by the Raiders. Just terrible. Down to the 11-yard line. Have to play somewhat special. 27-yard attempt. Longwell splits the uprights. Two minutes into the third. Santa Claus is here than Packers fans. Third down and ten. Well, Christmas has come early for the Packer fans. And they complete it to Rice, and then he has it batted out of his hands. But I think he comes up with it himself. He's the defender. Now Ju dislodged the ball, but he gets it back in a big hole for Wheatley. Wheatley inside the ten and then dragged down at the seven-yard line. The tough. Too late now. Second down and goal. From the nine, lost it, and then picked off by Hawthorne. So the playoff. Here. And Bubba Franks. To a baby girl, Mackenzie, giving Grandma Kathy something to cheer about. Grammy. Johnson takes off. Goes to the 36 yard line. Nick Lucci. Johnson near sack, and that's along the sidelines. Jerry Rice rolls it in. So that he's kind of taking Jerry Porter's play. You just saw Porter. Johnson almost gets sacked. You saw Cletus Hunt bang the ground in frustration, and that pass is incomplete. Third down and eight. Farr is going to launch this one. Between two defenders is Donald Driver to pull it in. Third down and nine. Far picks up another first down and. Keep it on the ground here and going nearly untouched into the end zone is Armand Green. Unbelievable night. And take a look at that. The rating is the highest of his career. Two of the three will go to the playoffs with all the permutations. We talked about those, but this night will be remembered for for Brett Favre. Period.